Hi, this is Coach Sandy, Wellness with Attitude, and this is my Thoughtful Thursday, a little adventure to have some time to speak with you. And the month of May is all about transitions. So last week we talked about the transitions from the things that we uh, take for granted to maybe being a little bit more aware and grateful. Now transitions can also um, mean growth. So the goddess of uh, growth is um, a part of May. Her name is Masis, I think is the correct way to say it. And so she encourages us to, to think about growth. Now there's a lot of different ways that we might think about growth. And so I'm gonna give you some topics that I think might um, help you to focus on it in a positive way. But I will say to you that it, the foundation, the fundamental component of growth comes from your belief. So we all have belief systems. We all have things that we believe in. We believe them to be true. And they may be true or they may not be so true when we go into further investigation. And some of our beliefs are stronger than others. We find that there are some areas that we might be a little bit more um, willing to consider other alternatives. So I'm gonna put you to a little bit of a, a possible test here, if you will. So when you think about your beliefs, there's lots of categories to go into. So one of them is myself, my body, my health, my work, my finances, I guess that's more than one, isn't it? So when you're thinking about tuning in, what, what part of, of are, are you tuning into? And here's a way to discover what your real feelings are about these different categories. So you might say, sometimes I believe my work is blank. Most often I believe that my health is blank. There are times that I believe that my body is blank. Most often, I believe that my finances are blank. So you're getting the idea of asking yourself the question, stopping long enough to think through it, um, write down the first things that come to mind because our logical brain has a way to evaluate things and, and go from right, wrong, black, white. Um, so just write down the first thing and maybe the second thing that come to mind when you fill in that blank. Because your beliefs will help you to see areas that you might choose to grow in. Um, and that's all about transitions. So when we decide to grow in an area, it means at that point in time, we're putting in some focus. We're putting in some maybe um, new directives for ourselves. So for example, if I went through this list and I'll give you a few more. Um, one uh, other topic is success. So you might write down, when I think about success, I believe it is blank. So let's take that topic and let's say that you wanna grow in your success and maybe it's your business success. Let's just take that as an example. Maybe you're an entrepreneur, maybe you're working for a large company, maybe you're thinking about change as far as the position that you hold, um, or success can also be um, how you feel in your personal life. And is it full? Are you looking for things externally to make you happy? So. When we think about these things, we ask ourselves the question and then we discover our beliefs. And I heard an interesting podcast the other day, which really made me stop and think, and I'll share it with you. Sorry, we've got FedEx coming. 